Hi, this is Pericles Bumparis, Assistant Professor in Finance and the Associate Director of uh, the MSc in Financial Risk Management at uh, Trinity Business School of Trinity College, Dublin. Uh, in this video, I will provide you some fundamental information regarding the MSc in uh, Financial uh, Risk Management. So, let me start this short presentation with some information uh, related to our recognition and to our rankings more broadly. So, first of all, we are very proud to be ranked second globally in insurance, risk and actuarial sciences from the Ed Universal Rankings website. We are only coming second after uh, the, univer the University of Leuven in uh, Belgium, but we are placed well above many global and well-recognized universities in, uh, the, uh, in Europe and uh, the United States. Uh, on top of that, uh, we are very proud to be officially recognized by the Global Association of uh, Risk Professionals. The Global Association of Risk Professionals is the, is, uh, the official uh, body of uh, risk uh, professionals. This is very important uh, for you in case you would like to get the qualification of financial risk management that is provided by the Global Association of Risk Professionals. In this case, our program will make that much easier for you since we will have covered a lot of the material that is required in uh, the Global Association and Risk Professional uh, exams. In addition, uh, I would like to mention that uh, the Master in Finance at uh, Business School uh, is ranked from the Financial uh, Times, uh, one of the most popular uh, rankings. Uh, so, the Master in Finance at Trinity Business School was ranked in 2020 uh, in the 18th position in, uh, in the European Union. Uh, it came fifth among Irish and uh, UK universities and it uh, holds the 27th position globally. The reason why I am referring to the Master in Finance uh, is because those two programs uh, have some modules in common. So some of our, co our core modules are shared with the Master in Finance. That is why we are, uh, I am highlighting to you uh, the ranking of our uh, Master in Finance. So let me go through now, let me continue and go through a little bit more about the structure of our program. So our pro uh, uh, the program uh, is split into three different terms. The in term one and in term two, you will attend to 12 different modules. And in term th three, you will have the opportunity to undertake a research project. From those 12 modules, uh, eight of them are compulsory for you, so you will have to undertake them. On top of those eight modules, you will have the opportunity to select extra four modules from uh, a range of uh, elective modules we usually offer to our students. Those modules will give you um, the chance uh, to get some expertise in something you, you find uh, more interesting or you believe that will give you uh, more chances to get uh, a job in a specific uh, area. Um, as I said, we share some modules with a master in, uh, in finance. For instance, in semester one, uh, you will share uh, uh, derivatives and corporate finance with students in uh, MSc in uh, financial, uh, sorry, in, uh, with MSc in uh, finance. Uh, we are going to cover every perspective of uh, risk management, ranging for credit risk, market risk, uh, operational risk. You are also going to work on credit and fixed income uh, securities. Um, you, are, you, will also, you will also be able uh, to quantify and measure risk, um, something that this is very, very important for you. Uh, hopefully after finishing uh, those 12 modules in semester one and in semester two, you will have the chance to undertake the, uh, our research project. Uh, I would like to highlight to you how important is that research project uh, for you. We have some very uh, we have some very recent examples of uh, graduates of our program that were able to get a job using 
they have a research project using their master thesis. So what you are going to do with that master thesis is that you, you will firstly uh, start by writing a research proposal in a topic that you find interest, interesting or in a topic that uh, you believe that the market uh, finds interesting, so it will increase the probability of you finding uh, a job. And based on that research uh, proposal and your choice, you will be allocated to a supervisor one of uh, our uh, faculty members or the industry experts who also teach in uh, the program. And based on that, you will be able to uh, work, to analyze data, to in uh, more broadly, um, to uh, get some expertise in uh, a very specific uh, topic. This is a piece of work, a personal uh, piece of work that uh, will qualify uh, the level of your uh, knowledge. It is something that you will take alongside during uh, your first interviews after uh, your uh, graduation. So what is next? Let me talk a little bit about our teaching and uh, learning approach. You will understand that this year was uh, really, really weird, really, really strange. Um, we cannot make any promises for next year, for next uh, September. We all understand that uncertainties are still around us. Uh, but based on the recent news, based on what happens with uh, uh, vaccines, based on our uh, trust in science, we are very optimistic that we will be able to return back to our normality. We will be able to return back to 100% face to face uh, teaching. Uh, if not, we still have a plan in mind, according to which we will be able to deliver a combination of face to face teaching and um, online uh, learning. This is actually what we followed in semester one, because unfortunately, based on the COVID-19 restrictions, we were not allowed to deliver 100% uh, face to face teaching. So based on this hybrid uh, structures. We split students in smaller groups and they had the opportunity, even under those restrictions, to get some face-to-face -face experience. As I said, we are very optimistic that next year uh, it uh, we will be able to return back to face-to-face, -to -face. but if and only if we are not allowed to do this, since that though some decisions go uh, beyond us, we still have a plan uh, uh, under consideration. So I am going to refer to some uh, tips we be, believe that are really important for you and, and that are not affected uh, from whether teaching will be fully face-to-face -face or a combination of face-to-face -face and uh, online. We believe it's very important for you, uh, your personal preparation and how you manage uh, your time. Uh, the program will provide you all those available tools that are required for you to to get uh, knowledge and experience in financial risk management. On top of that, we believe that it is very important for you to socialize and to stay connected uh, with uh, your peers in order to expand your, your network through uh, that uh, journey. As I mentioned earlier, uh, you will have the opportunity to engage both with faculty professors and with industry experts. Some of our modules are delivered from uh, faculty professors, for members of our um, staff, but some other modules are also delivered from industry, industry uh, experts. Um, we bring people from the industry to um, share with you, to give you all the industry uh, experience. So you have the opportunity to engage with, uh, most of, with both of them. Um, now, regarding uh, the delivery of uh, our uh, classes, we all believe that engagement of students is really, really important. So we do our best in order to make our material interesting. We incorporate uh, uh, real-time data. We incorporate uh, research papers. We incorporate sometimes news articles in uh, our lectures in order to make as real as possible for you. For instance, in uh, the delivery, uh, the, the derivatives module which I'm the module leader, you will have the opportunity uh, to work on the stock track platform and trade using uh, 
uh, real time data using data on de on uh, derivatives for your individual or group assignment. Um, apart from those assignments, you also have um, the chance to work with real time data. The school provides access uh, to databases like Bloomberg and uh, data stream icon, which give you real time data. You are going to use those data for your research project. You may be uh, going to analyze data on bonds, uh, stocks, or other uh, securities. Um, now regarding our regarding the regarding our assessment uh, path that varies from module to module but very broadly i could say that uh, usually a combination of assignments and final exams are incorporated this is important because we believe that we need to both give you the opportunity to study and work through that uh, through your semester and at the same time we use exams in order to be able to examine uh, the learning outcomes to to make sure that you have understand and you know all the material that has been discussed in uh, its module that is all i would like to share with you regarding the program specifically the teaching uh, and learning structure the modules you are going um, to be taught the research project which as i said is very very important so one of the uh, very common questions we usually hear from our prospective students is what happens after and we are very happy to show to you in these slides some of the companies our graduates are usually ex um, employed. You can see giants in that slide. You can see the name of Microsoft, BNB Pari uh, Paribas, uh, Google, uh, uh, Dropbox, all those companies which have offices in Dublin. I am going to show you in the next slide how important we consider our location and which advantage it gives to us. Uh, as I said, you can see gi the giants here, yes, JP Morgan, uh, Oracle. You will have the opportunity to apply for positions in those companies. And if everything goes well, we will be able to get an opportunity to work at one of those companies. Uh, now, I would say that a master in financial risk management or any master is not just the program or uh, itself is a journey it's a year that you will have the opportunity to do a lot of different things as i said we we are very lucky to be located at the heart of dublin we are very lucky as you can see in that mouth to be very very close to those companies here is our location is at trinity college uh here is, if I am not mistaken, the new building of the Trinity Business School. We have moved to a new building around one and a half year uh, ago, so you will have uh, the chance to work in a fantastic place where everything is really, really uh, new. Uh, see how close all those companies are to us, BFC, uh, Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter, Google, and uh, etc. This is one of our uh, advantages. Now, reg now regarding Dublin, as I said, we are located at the heart of Dublin city center, just a few minutes walk from uh, River uh, Liffey, a few minutes walk uh, from Temple Bar, of all those fantastic places I am pretty sure you would like to visit. For those of you that have never been to Dublin before, one of, the, of our advantages is that uh, this is an English-speaking country and an English speaking city so it will make much easier for you to settle in to a new environment this is very important uh, it is a place that it grows really really quickly and we believe that it continue to grow even after covid19 uh, pandemic uh, it's a place which uh, has a lot of different things to do uh, uh, it's a place full of uh, young uh, people uh, you will have the opportunity to walk around our fantastic campus. Uh, you will have the opportunity to go to the Trinity Library. This is 
one of the top, if not the number one tourist attraction uh, in uh, Dublin. I will, I will say to you only one thing to show you how beautiful uh, and how touristic Dublin is. I joined the school at August 2019 and within six to seven months, just before COVID-19 until March 2020, I had four different visitors. All of them wanted to uh, visit me in Dublin and go to those uh, very popular attractions like the uh, Trinity Library, as I said, um, the Guinness uh, store, which is very, very popular. I have been four times with all those visitors to that uh, place. So that was all uh, from uh, me for today. Thank you so much for watching that video. I hope you enjoyed that and uh, I hope it helped, it helped you to shape an idea on whether you would like to join us. Uh, in that slide, you can see how you can um, get in contact in case you would like to ask something. Uh, if you have uh, any questions, please don't hesitate uh, to email us. You can see in that slide the email of Ella, who is uh, the admission officer, officer of the program, so you can email her. You can also uh, send any questions to business uh, masters uh, at tcd.ee. Or if you have something in your mind that is uh, more academic, you would like to discuss directly with the associate director of the program, just drop an email to me at uh, boumprp at tcd.ie. In that slide, you can also see some useful links related to the university, and you can also connect with us in uh, social media and stay uh, connected uh, in order to see what happens uh, at uh, Trinity. You can see the uh, link to Twitter, Facebook, uh, LinkedIn or our Instagram account, and etc. So that was all for me. Huge thanks again for watching that video. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much. Bye.